everyone, this is Esquen from Online Tools Tutorials. In today's video, I am going to share with you how to use Google Drive for making uh, online attendance and uh, creating uh, surveys. In order to access Google Drive, you need to have your uh, Gmail account. So from the Gmail account, you can find the uh, Google Apps. So let's begin. So first of all, sign in to your Gmail account. Okay. I don't need to put my password and username or username and password because uh, I am already signed in. So click on the Google Apps and search for Drive. There you go. So now, click on the plus sign. Scroll it down until the end. Click this one and go to Google Forms. So now that you are in the Google uh, in the Google Form, change now the title. Let's say you are going to create an uh, online attendance uh, sheet. So attendance let's say uh, English club then put the dates or whatever information you would like to put let's say 11th July 2020 and uh, what time let's say uh, 3 30 uh, PM and then start typing now the information that you'd like to put so since this is attendance so it's very important to put the name so last name then change it to short answer and click on this it's a requirement you want to add another another uh, information click add uh, first name Okay, short answer, then it is required. Add another information, let's say uh, class or um, group or whatever, whatever, what's the name of your association, then you can put here. Change it to short answer and okay, let's say the last information is mobile uh, phone number short answer required so let's say that these are the information that you'd like to collect from the members or from your class go first to preview and check okay this is how it's going to look to, uh, to appear to your uh, to your team or to your students so you want to go back to the form click on this button okay and uh, here it is now go to theme check the color that you like okay add this one and then close so it's almost done go to settings now go to settings and change the uh, the file and add the following information so always tick on general if it is for attendance then collect email address response and limit to one response only and save so after you finish the settings you go now to send you click on send in order to uh, to create the link so click on this in the middle and this is now the link shorten the form so here you go and copy it that's it and close now the, the link that you copied can be uh, pasted on uh, your own website it can be pasted on your YouTube account 
or it can be pasted in a Google Classroom. So um, that's the convenience of uh, using uh, Google Drive. If you are the teacher or if you are the organizer of the meeting, you can go back to your uh, to your uh, Google Drive. So click on My Drive and look for the uh, the attendance or the online attendance that you created. So I have lots here. Copy of registration. Oh my God! Okay, here it is attendance english club so click on this and you will find here the uh, the responses so you have one response click on this and you can check the uh, attendees name or the attendees uh, gmail address and the name including the mobile number so if you want to see the uh, the individual list click on this and you will find the email address as well as the uh, question so you can create a spreadsheet actually and but this is spread uh, this uh, spread sheet is uh, applicable to uh, to quizzes only but if it is attendance it's fine to have the uh, the list of uh, names and gmail address so uh, this is the end of my uh, short uh, presentation i hope that you uh, learn something from this and uh, try to use this because this is uh, very convenient to uh, to use and uh, help a full tool for uh, teaching as well as for conducting uh, meetings